This is uh, Wayne Moore of Ashima. I just want to talk to you today about some of the uh, issues we had on the initial samples of the PCBs and the improvements we've made to the product over the course of the last 12 months. Um, the number one uh, issue we had from the market was the initial pad clearance. Um, some customers was experienced problems but when they set the, the brake up on the bike, it was actually dragging a little. Um, obviously this problem is being resolved now. Uh, the issue was actually to do with uh, the diaphragm construction. Uh, basically the diaphragm was compressing a little um, under the uh, ceiling load and changing the inner diameter so that the covers wouldn't retract. To solve this problem, if you have a look inside here, you can see we put a chamfer on the cover and that allow, guarantees that the cover will fully retract inside the diaphragm. So the problem's been resolved. Uh, you can see here on this uh, mock-up model. Uh, uh, the second issue we had was to do with the bleeding of the system. Uh, some customers were over tightening this bleed screw after bleeding and causing the plastic to crack. You can see now the production solution is to pull a brass insert inside the plastic injection molding so this screw actually butts up against the brass. The problem is resolved, it's gone away. Um, what we are doing as a company uh, with our distributors around the world and with uh, Centex from Brazil is offering customers upgrade uh, solutions to this. If you have any problems with your brakes in Brazil, please just contact your bike shops and they, they will resolve these issues. Ashman will support.